this will affect them. Because it doesn't, just, this is not, I'm not trying to take away from Michael, but I've done this before. It's not just pain compliance. What we've had before is an arm bar, a baton, caps done. I had to hit you in certain places to make you obey me and do what I wanted you to do. And if you're motivated or drunk, that's it. You can fight through that. This one is like white noise. If you, it puts out what's called a taser wave, and it's like myself and Mr. Ashley trying to talk in whispers across the room and everybody shouting. That's what it does to your central nervous system. It just cuts it off so that it confuses it, and that's the incapacitation part. The taser doesn't look like this when it's deployed on a, an actual person. This is kind of just for demonstration, so you can see the electricity rotating around. Yeehaw! Oh, boy. Just as long you have that in the mirror. That's the incapacitation part. <laughs> so, does it make them really bad? Take a shot, though. That's what I want. Yeah, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> what I've done is just take those to his back as if we had shot him with the probes, but we don't put holes in good guys. Yeah. Can we auction off the, who gets to squeeze the trigger? <laughs> <laughs> He's this at fundraiser. God, if you ever want to do that to your boss? Guess <laughs> what you work for? Right. Count to five there, Sheriff. Sure. Four. One, three, two. One, two. Ah! <laughs>